Hi guys, today we are going to try and uh, demonstrate to you how you can live trade uh, on GoCharting using your Kotex Securities DMAT account. Okay, So the way it works is on the right hand panel you will see um, Kotex panel. So this is how you open your right hand panel. You will see Kotex Securities and I select on Kotex Securities and this is where we enter all the credentials. Now I have made a separate video to walk you through how you can enter all these credentials. If you are still not sure, you can see there is a link here. Not sure how to fill up the form. Just click on it and it will open up an article and you can go through the article and figure out step by step what are the steps you need to take in your Kotec uh, account to kind of get all these details that you need to fill in. So there are four important fields. User ID, that's your trading account username. Password, that's your, your trading account password. And then there is consumer key and access token. These are API keys and tokens that you will have to generate. And the process to generate this is uh, detailed out here in this um, link that you can see that I have the cursor on. So uh, I'm not going to go into how you generate these tokens and uh, API keys, but I'm just going to go ahead and enter and show you how we trade on it, right? So assuming that you have followed these instructions and you have generated your consumer key and your access token i'm gonna go ahead and show you how to connect so i'm gonna enter my details i have to agree to the terms and conditions and i have to click on connect once i click on connect uh, a validation process will happen and within a few seconds you will be validated and you are now connected to the broker which is kotak just to be doubly sure we are going to use this ledger panel and going to check, you know, all the trades uh, that we have taken. So I have taken, I had done a order today in the morning on Chennai Petroleum and, and, and that order is showing up here. So I'm just going to go ahead and now go ahead and show you. So you, all your trades will be, all your executed trades will be in this panel. Your orders open, filled, canceled. You can just choose from this toggle what you want will be showing here. Your positions will show here and that's how it is. So you can also enlarge it, you know, you can maximize and you can see all your positions and everything in here. Okay. So this is the ledger panel and right next to is the trade panel. The basically the trade panel is where you enter all the details, whether you want a limit order, market order, stop order, stop limit. So you enter all your details. Kotak is the broker here that you will automatically have it selected. Kotak here, as you can see, is the broker that we are working with now. These are Kotak related details, like whether it's a regular order or a smart order, whether it's an intraday delivery, whether it's a super multiple MIS, all these options that you are normally aware of, all of that will happen here. Okay. So, so, so that's how uh, it is configured right now. Okay. So I'm going to choose delivery here okay and set it as a default so i'm going to do a regular delivery and a normal order okay so that's what i'm going to do and it will be in a gfd validity okay so one way is i can punch in the order from here i can put some value like 117.8 which will which will place an order here this is one of the ways the other uh, simpler way is you can move your mouse and place it wherever you want on the chart itself okay and right click and it will give you options buy limit buy market sell stop so depending on where you, your cursor is relative to the ltp it the, the 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 charting platform will automatically give you some smart options right that if if your uh, for example cursor is below the ltp it has to be a buy limit it cannot be a sell limit right so if i move it up it will show me above the if i if i place the cursor and right click above the ltp it will show me sell ltp if i place it below it will show me buy ltp so it will give me all the you know right options relative to where you have placed your mouse come uh, relative to the ltp so i want to place an order at 120 for example okay so i'm going to go ahead and buy limit okay and then buy once i buy order got placed as you can see here if i wish i can close it confirm to delete yes i confirm okay and your order for chennai petrochemicals has been deleted now if i go to the ledger i can see that the order was placed and order was cancelled